Hi, this is LaDonna with the Ashley Saw Stars. I'm at the um, LA Comic Con, you know, formerly known as Stanley's Kamikaze and um, Comic Con. It's um, really, really great. They just um, had the mad dash to let everybody in. Um, people were running. I got a uh, souvenir of that. And um, this is maybe my third, third, fourth year um, of covering um, the Comic Con. And um, I'm really excited to be here. I'm very thankful to be here. I'm not feeling that well. I had a hard time um, making it in and stuff like that. I'm only here um, a few hours, um, you know, for the first day. And then tomorrow I'll see what's going on. Um, if I'm going to be here tomorrow, after how long, and then Saturday or Sunday, um, for how long. Um, a lot of the people here are, I don't know, they look sort of new or whatever, new faces, but there's some people with um, costumes on and everything like that. It looks very exciting um, with their, well, I'm hoping it'll be really exciting with costumes and stuff like that. A lot of people are just sort of standing around, milling around. Of course, um, you know, that doesn't really matter or whatever. It's whatever you want to um, focus on. Um, downtown LA is sort of um, sort of quiet today. It is Friday. Um, I was going to fit them. It's sometimes be quiet on Fridays or whatever. But um, hopefully I'll pick up um, this weekend and we'll sort of see um, what's going on. Um, you know, with the Comic Con, it's, there's tons to do, I'm sure, in LA. Um, I'm going to be here and I'll be writing and um, writing on my blog and sort of um, catching people up on what I've been doing. I missed the country roll because my car broke down, but I did cover it. Anyway, it was a good show. I'm going to be doing like a post um, follow up on the piece, and I, I'm really excited about that. Have some great shots and stuff like that, and so I'll be uploading it and then um, hopefully writing about it um, like tomorrow. I sort of mentioned it in this post. Um, then after that, I'm probably going to do um, a little post on where I'm going to be um, for the upcoming year. I'm um, hopefully, you know, alive, and then hopefully um, covering different um, uh, shows and stuff like that. I was hoping to do um, some of the red carpets this year. I didn't really get my um, applications in um, on time. I've been sort of busy. My um, car broke down, I was sick, and then my mom died um, earlier this year. And so, um, so I'm really thankful to be here. It's been a lot of mishaps and stuff like that. A lot of issues with the veteran affairs, the VA hospitals, a lot of issues with the VA. And I've sort of been writing about that. I will be covering it, you know, as always, you know, on my blog. And then I'm sort of doing this new stuff with my hair. I did, um, I had a fro that did not go right. And now it's going right. Okay. You can see sort of some of my little tendrils or whatever. And, um, but it's sort of this new, um, sort of uh, fro that I wanted to try to bring in. And it was like one of those things. Yeah. Um, my hair has some, sometimes like what they call two strand or something like that, okay? And so I had to get it all cut in order for it to come in great. And so now I'm sort of rocking it and sort of doing what I like. Okay, for those of you that are into hair, natural hair, natural curly hair, afros, black hair, colored hair, colored people hair, okay? <laughs> um, girl hair, okay? And then um, people with curls, all right? Then um, take a look at my fro, take a look at my do and see what you can do do for your do. All right, now, um, after that, I'm going to um, talk a little bit about hair because um, what's really in is um, wigs. Wigs are really big, big trend as we're looking at Comic-Con, looking at costumes. And also you sort of see like this sort of dropping of, um, I don't know, demographics where you see people that you think are old as dirt, you know, rocking the hair, rocking the colors, rocking the, you know, the frocks, okay, um, the wigs and stuff like that. And you see youth. Um, younger ages wearing colored hair, little um, colors and stuff like that, um, where maybe you might not otherwise let them uh, dye their hair. They're sort of dyeing it and wearing a wig and stuff like that. And it's not just for um, Comic-Con. And we're sort of in the Comic-Con age, you know, moment or whatever. And we're near Halloween. So a lot of times people get away with things um, costume-wise um, before their age or a supposed age or whatever. And um, that's sort of how um, people do it. And so... Um, what we're going to look at over this weekend is likely hair. Um, things of hair, things of wigs, what you can do. Can you wear a wig if you have a, a do like this? It, or, you know, or is your do wig enough? You know? Do you really need to cover up your hair? And then who's trying to rock your hair? You know, take it as a compliment, not as a, a call to battle. And then sort of look at this thing of, I wish I could have colored my hair. No, look at your hair is great and you saw some gray hair. Okay? You don't need to have the hate. 
uh, life is too short, and a lot of people will realize it. So you know, this is how it is, and um, I'm gonna press on. And this is Ladonna with Magic Stars. Talk to you soon. Okay, bye.